News 4 at 5 starts now. And welcome to News 4 at 5. The cause of a fire is under investigation this evening after it destroyed a family's home on Thanksgiving Day. But as News 4's Forrest Sanders found out, some people close by are stepping up to show what it means to be a neighbor. It's a really great neighborhood. Everybody's friendly. It's a really good community. All the other parents around here, they take you in as their own kid. Living on a block where people know each other, care about each other, well, actually, I matters a lot to Shelly Stone Bailey so and I'm son Jacob. Today, and, uh, a family on their Mill Springs Drive in Smyrna is hurting after a devastating night. We were asleep. My mom, she smelled something burning. She called everybody, fire. All, all we were doing, just screaming and yelling. Crews fought this fire in the earliest hours of Thanksgiving morning as the flames took the home of Naim Krasnicki and his family. We lost basically everything. I have a car in a garage that um, I use for Uber, full-time driver. I can't even work because the car is in there burn. Lose everything. All of this feels so familiar for Shelly and Jacob. Living in another city six years ago, they also went through a tragedy. It was nine days before Christmas and um, we lost our place in a fire. So with this, Shelly and Jacob thought it's time to pay it forward. Thank you, neighbor. You're Thank welcome. you so much. Thank You're you. welcome. God, God bless you. Thank you. God bless you. We thought it was our turn to give back from when we had help. They're collecting clothes and shoes for names family. Anything that could help. I love my neighbors. They're all good. They're all good. Shelly and Jacob say this is what it means to be a neighbor. I know how it feels to lose everything you have. We survived it. Just everything's going to be okay. In Smyrna, I'm Forrest Sanders, News 4. Neighbors helping neighbors, it's a wonderful thing. If you'd like to help this family, we'll have a link to a donation page and Shelly's contact information on our website, WSMB.com.